good morning my dear students and welcome back to the class on english literature i hope you have understood the summary of act 4 scene 1 and as we have taken up to paragraph 15 i hope you are clear so far so we move on with today's class we begin from paragraph 16 onwards so for you remember the duke we are the scene is set in the court of venice the duke is there and don't you guys and all those people are there now they are waiting for shylock to come now let's see what happens here now shylock has entered now shylock has entered into the court now what happens now we will see one more time the duke is trying to change the mind of shylock that's what we are going to learn now so let's see make room it means make some space and let him stand before our face him prefers to shylock let shylock stand in front of us shylock now the duke is again once again trying to make or to change the decision of shylock let's see how it happens shylock the world thinks the whole world knows your character that means you are a very cruel person and you will take revenge and i think so too so the whole world and i refers to the duke so the duke tells that the whole world and i think that you but leads this fashion of thy malice it means this act of cruelty fashion of thy malice means this action of cruelty what is the action of cruelty here that he wants or he is insisting on the one pound of flesh to the last tower of act so the whole world thinks or i to think that you will continue your act of cruelty to the last tower and then it is thought but then we think thou will show thy mercy but we think something different what is that we think you will show mercy and remorse remorse means pity more strange than is thy strange apparent cruelty apparent cruelty means now you appear to be very very cruel person okay and what will be strange if you are able to show mercy and pity that will be something very strange considering your nature so once again the whole world thinks that you will show you will become you will continue you will continue to show the cruelty the cruel action to the last hour but then what happens something strange what do we expect that if you are showing mercy and pity it will be something strange to your nature or change uh, something different to your character and where thou now exhaust the penalty insist means insist the penalty penalty is one pound of flesh which is a pound of flesh which is a pound of this poor merchant's flesh so what happens here is again now you are insisting on the one pound of flesh of antonio i hope you are understanding so on saying let's start from the beginning let antonio let shilo come and let him stand in front of us and it tells the whole world things and i do think that you will lead or you will continue to show, you will continue to exhibit or continue to show this act of cruelty to the last tower of action but then we think if you are able to show mercy and pity it will be something very strange to your apparent cruelty means to, to your cruel nature so the shylock is considered as a person who is able to take revenge who is who is ready to take revenge on other people or a person considered as very cruel but apart from or by a, but what happens if by chance if he is able to show mercy and pity it will be something different of his nature now what happens here now you are insisting on one pound of flesh from the body of him antonio thou wilt not only lose the forfeiture which means you will not only refuse not only lose the forfeiture means you will refuse to accept the penalty that antonio should pay Okay, lose the forfeiture means you will you will not only refuse to accept the money that is to be given by Antonio, but touched, but you will be touched with the human gentleness and love. Forgive a moiety of the 
principal moiety means a portion of the principal means a, here the meaning is a, the total amount that is supposed to pay so what happens and uh, Shylock will not only forget the for feature which means the the bound of the <coughs> you will not only lose the for which means Shylock will not only forget the bond which means uh, the original sum the penalty that is to be given by Antonio or what happens touched with gentleness but Shiloh will be touched by gentleness and love will be touched with gentleness and love then what, what he will do he will forgive a portion of the principal principle the sum that is to be given by given by Antonio so what happens Shiloh will not only forget about the bond but he will also forgive a portion of the sum that is to be paid by Antonio I hope you are understanding now let's move on glancing an eye of pity on his losses whose losses Antonio so you will glance you will, glance, you will show an eye of pity on the losses what are the losses of Antonio he has lost many ships he has lost the ship which means he doesn't have the money so what happens you will show pity on the losses of Antonio that have off late Adil Adil means accumulated on his back which means the losses that have come on Antonio enough enough means enough to press a royal merchant down those losses are enough to put down a merchant and pluck commiseration of said commiseration means draw pity which means you will be able to draw pity see the condition of Antonio from brassy bosoms and rough hearts of flint to offices of tender courtesy once again from brassy bosoms and rough hearts of flint from stubborn turks and attracts never trained to offices of tender courtesy now you know what happens now the duke is trying to make a comparison here now what is that doing just before that you have said you will see see in the condition of which means the Antonio have got enough losses those losses are enough to put him down so see in the condition of Antonio you will be able to draw pity for him and from brassy bosoms means the meaning is hearts as hard as brass brassy bosoms means hearts as hard as brass rough hearts of flint flint means rough stony hearts these are the characters of whom from stubborn turks and tatras means those are the races who were uncivilized so elizabethan people believed that the races like turks and tatras they were never trained in civilization which means they were uncivilized to offices of tender courtesy which means you will not be like one of them which means what are those what are the what what is the speciality of these two races their hearts are as hard as brass and their heart their they have got very rough stony hearts and they are uncivilized they are not trained to civilization so you will not become like you will not be you will not be like one among them we all expect a gentle answer you we are expecting a gentle very quiet answer from you so let's go through it once again here what happens is that our the duke is trying to convince him convince Shiloh that you need to show mercy so the first thing he will tell he will the duke tells that the nature of Antonio, the nature of Shiloh. What is the nature of Shiloh? That it is that he is supposed to be a person who will take revenge on other people and who will show, who will be very cruel person. And then what is the strange thing that, that can happen? The strange thing that he he will show mercy or he will show pity to Antonio. That will be something very strange to his character or nature. Then once is touched by once he is touched with a human gel and what he will do he will not only forget the 
born but he will also forgive or to forgive a portion of the money that is to be paid by antonio once he is touched with the kindness or mercy then it tells you know antonio has got enough losses those losses are enough for a for a person for a merchant to be down then what happens in the last part it tells him the duke believes that he will not be like the turks or tatars who are never trained in acts of charity or acts of kindness their hearts are as as hard as brass and their rough stony hearts so we are expecting we are all waiting for an answer from you now what is the reply of a uh, wowdus shylock respond i have possessed your grace of what i purpose i have possessed means i have possessed your meaning is it i have informed you your grace means do i have informed your duke what is my decision purpose means what is my decision and by a holy sabbath have i sworn so means i have taken a promise on a sabbath day to have the due and the forfeit of my bond so what is the promise taken by shylock he has taken an oath on the holy sabbath that sabbath means holy sabbath means the holy the holy very very good the holy day that is given to the jewish people like christians we have to sunday for them it is the sabbath it is a very holy day for them or you or it is the holy day means it is a sunday or the seventh day of the jewish week which is considered as a very sacred day on that day what happened shylock has taken a promise an oath that he will have both the bond and the money that is to be given by our antonio if you deny it it means if you do not give me justice let danger light light here meaning meaning is fall upon your charter and your cities freedom charter means the <coughs> the document by which our the venice the place venice has got independence and cities freedom means on the freedom of uh, or the law of venice if you deny me if you do, if you do not give me justice what happens danger will come on your place on the place called venice you will ask me why i rather choose to have a weight of carrion flesh than to receive 3000 ducats you will ask why you will ask me people are asking shylock that why are you insisting why are you insisting on one pound of flesh of antonio than the 3000 ducats i will not answer that i do not want to answer it so carrion flesh means rotten flesh so people are asking shylock shylock why are you insisting on the one pound of rotten flesh of antonio why don't you receive or why don't you accept the 3000 ducats shylock tells i will not answer that i do not like to answer you but say it is my humor it is my fun it is my joke is it answered have you got the answer so this is how shylock replies so once again i have informed you the decision of the my decision and by holy sabbath the holy sabbath it is the sunday the seventh day of the week which is considered sacred day for a jewish people and on that he has taken the pro, uh, taken the promise or oath that he will have the bond and the money that is to be given by shailo by antonio if you do not give me justice what happens there will be danger for your law and the freedom then you will ask me why are why am i insisting on one pound of flesh of antonio it is my fun it is my joke it is my humor is it is it an answer for you so i will attend answer i hope you have understood just go through the video once again and if there is any doubt you can ask me thank you